This is Alan Turing, on June 23, 1912, he was brought into this world, and would go on to do something phenomenal, that would save the lives of many people. But who exactly is he? Alan, was seen as a brilliant mathematician, and had great knowledge in cryptanalysis, philosophy and was seen as the father of computer science, most of all, he played a pivotal role in breaking Nazi Enigma codes during World War II. From a young age, he displayed signs of high intelligence, which some of his teachers found quite intimidating. By the age of 13, he became particularly interested in maths and science. After high school, he enrolled at the University of Cambridge, studying there from 1931 to 1934. In 1936, Turing delivered a paper, on computable numbers, with an application to the Entscheidungsproblem, in which he presented what was to be called, the Universal Turing Machine, which was a device capable of computing anything associated with computers. This was considered, the precursor to the modern computer. Over the next, two years, Turing studied mathematics and cryptology at the Institute for Advanced Study in Princeton in New Jersey. After receiving his PhD from Princeton University in 1938, he returned to Cambridge, and then took a part-time position with the Government Code and Cipher School, which is a British code-breaking organization. During World War II, Turing was a leading participant in wartime code-breaking, particularly that of German ciphers. He worked at Bletchley Park, the GCCS wartime station, where he made five major advances in the field of cryptanalysis, including specifying the bomb, an electromechanical device used to help decipher German in Enigma encrypted signals. Turing's contributions to the code-breaking process didn't stop there, as he also wrote two papers about mathematical approaches to code-breaking, which became such important assets to the code and cipher school. Sadly with his great achievements in the field of technology, Turing took his own life in 1954, two years after being outed as a homosexual. Homosexuality was still a crime in Great Britain at the time, and Turing was convicted of indecency. He died from eating an apple laced with cyanide, at the age, of 41 years old. Nevertheless, his legacy for what he brought would impact the future of technology and leave himself, in a great place in the eyes of many, in history.